Hey guys, what is going on? My name is Otis Under, and today I've got a pretty cool kind of uh, unboxing slash overview review slash of this. Basically, um, I'm not really going to show off the box as it was something rather simple. It comes nicely packaged in just a brown box like so. Inside there is uh, nothing on the bottom and then an actual picture of the scope in the kind of white negative look on top. Inside that you do get a spare battery and a nice little cleaning cloth. But this, this right here, this is the biz. So for quite a while, anybody who's in, been into Airsoft and has loved the Dragonoff SVD has been wanting a proper Dragonoff scope. And the worst thing about these was you could either get a one from Japan, which was going to cost you around about £200-£300, or you'd have to buy the real steel one, which was considerably more. Um, this one here, this is a Chinese replica slash clone type thing. And basically, this retails for around about $100, $100 which probably is only about 60 70 80 quid. So it is ridiculously cheap and well-priced, but really does show off the good kind of quality and uh, everything else about it is pretty damn neat as well. It really is a very nice bit of kit. So obviously it is a full kind of clone replica. You've uh, got your little rubber cap at the end there. You've got your extender to, uh, for your like, lens hood for, to help against the um, the sunlight reflecting the lens. Uh, obviously you've got your rubber eye cap there which is completely uh, like it's kind of hollow bit there. And then the lens itself actually starts there. You've got your, uh, your, quick, um, your quick focus there which is the left and right so it focuses in. You've got your... Um, Obviously, you've got your up and your down. You've got your left and your right uh, to basically zoom in uh, zero or zero in your crosshairs. Um, and then obviously under here as well, you do have a switch for the light. And now this is a, a proper dragon scope, which you may or may not be able to see just through there. I don't know if I can get a better focus on that actually. Yeah, well, there we go. Yeah, there's the focus. Um, I don't know how well the light's going to show. Up. But yeah, there we go. You can see that quite well actually. But as you can see, that's. Uh, it is a red illuminating rifle scope, which is pretty nice as well. It does look very nice. Um, it is very clear scope, and you can have that off and on whenever you wish. Just simply by the flick of a button and that tiny little watch battery there. And uh, obviously, you've got your very nice eye relief there as well, which is a quite nice feature for this. And uh, this is made out of metal, so it's a very strong, sturdy bit of kit. Um, I'm going to try and borrow a Dragon off um, SVD off my friend. I'll borrow his one. He's got an ANK Dragon off in black, so this will look very, very nice on that gun. I'm going to ask him if I can borrow that for review, and I'll probably even let him keep the. Uh, keep the scope for his uh, gun um, and literally have that place on there just to kind of show you what it looks like and probably do like an actual review of the Dragonoff gun at the same time as well so you can kind of get a whole kind of package deal maybe. Um, but there we go, this really is a awesome bit of kit, it really does feel nice, it's got a lovely weight to it. Uh, with the Dragonoff one, instead of having a like a 22mm a 20, uh, 20 um, Picatinny rail, whatever you call it, um, where it mounts on it. It literally mounts on the side rail that uh, the only the Dragon Ops and some AKs have. So it mounts perfectly on the side there, which uh, is a very nice feature. And obviously, it does it really does look the biz. It's very unique. Um, there's not many people out there who have them because uh, they were quite pricey to begin with. But there we go, guys. The fact that you can now get a proper AK Dragon Ops scope for this sort of price really does do the biz. And just to give you some of the close-up details of this thing, it really does look very very nice. Yeah, a little switch down there. And the lens in there. Maybe you can see that again, but uh, <laughs> that's a bit out of focus right now. But there we go. It really does look like a beautiful bit of kit. It is very, very well crafted. Really is a very, very nice bit of kit. So uh, overall guys, I want to say thank you very much, I hope you've kind of enjoyed this quick video, basically kind of announcing that you can pick up one of these from Tiger11HK, um, obviously shipping over here, it only takes a little while, it's not too long actually, it's quite fast shipment, but there we go, for that sort of price as well, I don't mind waiting a few extra days to get it shipped to me from uh, China, Japan, wherever it comes from, but it really is an amazing bit of kit, very very nice. Fit your dragon off perfectly, and it also makes it look the biz. No more uh, normal scope sitting on a dragon off. You've got the official bit of kit just here. Uh, very, very cheap as well, guys, because obviously it is a Chinese clone. So all you got to do is you got to check out Tiger One One HK. The link to the actual product will be in the description there, and also there's plenty of more products from their website as well. Uh, they very kindly sent me an AK drum mag as well, which I'm going to do a review on. So I want to say thank you very much, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will see you guys next time.